Coach, a difficult loss today for your team to Grand Valley. Go ahead and just talk about today's match. Yeah, it's a, it's a tough one. Uh, obviously, emotions are running kind of high. Uh, you know, we we came off a little flat in doubles, but we picked it up in singles, and I thought we played really good. It's just Grand Valley. I mean, it was uh, it was a battle out there. I mean, we had five of the six matches go to a third set, which just means it's unbelievably even tennis. And uh, and you know, all credit goes to them. They they played really really well. I thought we fought hard. Um, just came up short in a few matches, and that's 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 tough. You know, the four four zero score doesn't exactly say what happened on the court out there today, uh, but. Uh, but it's a tough one. It's always, it's always tough to end the season like this, uh, especially when you're the higher seed. Um, but uh, but we knew we knew what was gonna you know we knew that Grand Valley could bring it like this and uh, and you know we just have to learn from it and hopefully uh, you know the the underclassmen coming back you, you use this as a little bit of fuel um, and and you know it's gonna be sad to see the seniors go but I know they'll still be a part of a, this program for a long time so yeah it's a tough one today. Talk a little bit more about the the seniors and also just how proud you are of this group for what they accomplished this season. Yeah, I mean, you know, we, we reached a lot of goals this year, and we uh, we had a lot of great moments. I mean, you know, we, we our, our only losses until this point were to the top two teams in the country. Um, so, you know, it, uh, it it is tough, but I, I'll tell you that, uh, that, you know, the seniors were losing. You know, I've been here, you know, I've only been here six years, so four of them have been with them. Um, and uh, they're just part of the family. Uh, It'll it'll be tough, but I know that they'll they'll be they'll be with us for a long time. They've already asked me not to remove them from our group chat because they want to pump up the team next year. Uh, so, so yeah, it, uh, it it it's a difficult one. But these seniors uh, really represented Ferris really well. So I mean, everyone on the team did, um, and that's what we ask at the end of the day that uh, that they represent themselves and the team really well. And one co uh, question for me, Coach Doran. Last time you faced them, you beat them seven to nothing, and what happened this time around? Is it? Uh, did you notice? Uh, did they surprise you a little bit? Did you notice they have made big improvements from then till now? Yeah, no, no surprising. I mean, even the, like I said, that was a 7-0 victory, but it was really close. Just like today, 4-0 victory, very close. So no, I'm not surprised. And they've always been an excellent outdoor team. They have a lot of players that just grew up playing outdoors. And and you know, it's one of the hardest things about you know being in the Midwest. You know, I I, I do recruit a lot of indoor players because 95 percent of our season is indoors um so i, I knew that they're going to bring it and hey she even put in a couple seniors there at the end of the match that haven't played a lot this year but their seniors you know really stepped up and uh so no i mean it's scores are so difficult to look at and really know that it doesn't paint the full picture uh so that's gonna be the hardest thing that i'll have to get through to my team is is you know you know, we, we, we fought, and that's the thing. We, we weren't overlooking them because we knew that at 7-0 during the season, indoors, uh, on fast courts, and uh, so we knew they'd bring it, and they did. And, uh, and we still played great tennis. We just came up short.